Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, since we have been waiting for so long for a jailbreak, why not make a tutorial on how to actually sideload some applications and tweaks in order to customize some apps to make it better. So with that being said, let's get straight into this video. So in this video demonstration, I'm going to be sideloading YouTube Plus Plus. Now I will be displaying a list of what applications that you guys can use on this hack. So if you guys want to actually hack that app, go ahead and follow along. So since I'm going to be doing YouTube Plus Plus, we want to go ahead and delete the actual app off your phone first. Now, since we got that out of the way, we can go ahead and minimize that. And you guys want to go ahead into Google Chrome or whichever browser you guys want and head over to the first link in the description below. So you'll get to see this page as PP Sideloader and you guys want to go ahead and press the download zip and go ahead and extract it to your desktop. Now for this demonstration as well, you will need a decrypted IPA file. Go ahead and head over to iPhoneCake.com. Go ahead in the top right hand corner right here and go ahead and search whichever app you want. So I found YouTube right here and you guys want to just scroll down until you find actual links. So thank you for the Cracker Widow for allowing us to use his cracked application. So once you have your actual cracked app as well as the PP side loader, you guys want to go ahead and open up the PP side loader folder. Now containing inside the folder is app.ipa. You guys want to go ahead and right click and move to trash or delete it. And we're going to go ahead and drag in our decrypted file inside. Now we want to rename the IPA file to app.ipa. Now once that is settled, you guys want to go ahead and click on the Xcode project file. Now as usual, let Xcode do its thing real quick and it will say that it's ready. So go ahead and click on the left hand side where it says PP side loader and it'll automatically go to general. If not, go ahead and click that. So you guys will need to be able to tie your account in. So you guys want to go ahead and press X code preferences and you guys want to go ahead and add your account here. It'll look very different and this whole spot will be blanked out because I do not want you guys to know my credentials. So once you guys are in fact signed in where it says team, you guys want to go ahead and choose your team. Click that and press fix issue. But before you guys click on fix issue, you guys want to go ahead and select everything inside the bundle identifier and choose whatever you want. So for example, I did com.eah for elite apple hacks and I put yt for youtube.youtube. Now also go ahead and select your team and go ahead and press fix issue. All right, so once the issue has been fixed, you guys want to go ahead and click on deployment target and make sure it's on the iOS that you guys are on. So for example, I'm on 9.2 and go ahead and select that or if you guys are on 9.1 or 9.3, go ahead and select those. Now I will assume if you guys are on 9.3.1, you guys wanna go ahead and select 9.3. So once that's done, you guys wanna go ahead and make sure that your device is connected and it is checkmarked in the device category and you guys wanna go ahead and press play. All right, so it said that it is succeeded and it is now installing on my device. That did take about two minutes in order to start processing the files. So during step two in the installation, give it a couple minutes and you guys should be good to go. All right, so now it says running PP side loader on error or your device name. So let's go ahead and check this out on our device. So on our springboard, we now see that we have YouTube plus plus. And if you guys are aware and if you guys get this error, you guys want to go ahead and go into settings, general, and then you guys want to go down and select your profile under profiles and device management. Now, once you guys do enable it, you guys want to go ahead and launch your application. All right, so we do see that we do have ads on the very bottom. You guys want to go ahead and just exit that out. And you guys notice that the whole entire interface is actually different. So in the top, in the middle, we do actually get our downloads. So as you guys can see, we can in fact download videos. And if you guys want to go ahead and go to the very right on the top bar, you guys do see that it is the download page as well. Now, for example, let's go ahead and see one of my videos and see what I can do. So let's go ahead and launch up my latest tutorial on setting up a Hackintosh. So as you guys can see inside of the play area, you guys can see that we do have the playback speed, which is that one right now. And we guys can go ahead and rewind by 10 seconds or go forward by 10 seconds. And going down, you guys can see that there is in fact a download button right next to the like and dislikes. So we do get an option to choose which quality we guys want, ranging from audio to 720p. So there guys go, a tutorial on how to obtain YouTube Plus Plus or another Plus Plus app that you guys desire, depending on whichever app you guys wanted to do. You guys can go ahead and choose up to all the apps you want if you guys have and use any of the apps that I listed before. 
So if this tutorial was easy to follow, go ahead and leave a like down below and also subscribe to get tutorials just like this in the future, as well as the tutorial once the new jailbreak is in fact released. Also go ahead and follow me on my Twitter page as well as my Facebook page in order to be informed on news on when I'm making new videos as well as jailbreak content. So with that being said guys, I'll see you guys in my next video. This is Elite Apple Hacks, signing out.